Hello McWarriors, how's it going and welcome to another episode of Rogue Take, the turn-based strategy game built around the Battletech universe. I think we're gonna just repair our mechs today and then we dive directly into one or maybe even two missions because I want to get some more assault mech parts. We are still in the, mm, in the process preparing for the super late game, hunting down some super heavy mechs. So I think we're just gonna click that button, send some mirror with the leopard, we lose 50,000 sea bills and we're gonna continue our ride. Okay, that was not that good, but it doesn't matter too much. Sometimes exploring the moons is good. Sometimes you find some things. All right, so we are technically ready to go. The question is, where do we want to go? We have some very high tier missions here. Um, I don't think I want to go all overboard with my challenge right now, especially not in an urban environment. Defending a base could be fun. We're gonna get some good money and good salvage out of here. Escort? Nah. Uh, recovery in urban environment. All of this is not great. We could play a battle, but it's also urban. You know what? Today, we're gonna defend a base. Playing against the Terran Hegemony. Hegemony? Uh, I don't know how to say it. But we're gonna get the salvage. We're gonna get... I don't know, I would say all of our goodies on the battlefield. We are on par with the difficulty in terms of our lands value. As much as I want to train Oddball. He's too annoying. I have to say it. He is sadly too annoying. I cannot take him to the battlefield anymore because he really gets on my nerves. Sorry, man. It's nothing personal except for it is. I don't like him. So, here we go, guys. We're gonna get our goodies and see what we can do today. So, we are in. This is Optimus Prime, right? Oh, my God. Ah, guys, don't get too much overboard with all the, the anecdotes and um, hmm, hmm, hmm. other things that you're putting in here. Uh, I mean, a little bit of crossover is fine, but I think it's getting a little bit too out of hand, too much here. Let's, uh, let's drop just right here. We're gonna see where enemies are coming from and then we're gonna adapt. And that's the basic plan for today. Obviously, we wanna try to get our turrets online. So therefore, we have to protect our little guys, wherever they might be. Oh, all the way over here. All right, all right, all right, all right. So, quick battlefield overview. Marauder, Primus, Optimal. <laughs> Fine. Warhammer 66. We have a Lembor Yellow. Well, that's, that's Bumblebee, right? Uh, there's Grimdark. There's Helapolis. King Crab. What the hell is going on here? I have no idea. So let's go ahead. Power Armor. We have some things that we can do too. We're gonna convert our Sea Riders. Let's do it. And I think we're gonna stay in cover for the moment. Just for the first phase of the game. 66 has two ballistic, two missile, two energy. This Bola just needs one more turn to get into the zone, by the way, and I think he will be. He will be able to do so. And then we're gonna get a heavy Calliope, hardened auto cannon emplacement. Ooh, where are the other turrets? Up here. Another hardened auto cannon emplacement. Looking good. Ah! This is the Flying Marauder. This is a Flying Timber Wolf. Uh huh. The Flying Marauder, the Flying Catapult. No, it's a Flying Mad Cat. Cool. Uh, yeah, we have one of those as well. Gonna bring it in. We're gonna do our best. Yeah, this is totally a transformer. Why? All right. Cool. All right, I heard about those. Right, these are these mm, mechs that could convert into flying units are now supplemented by mechs that could convert into ground units. These are those guys. All right. Optimal. Wow, you got an arrow and a heavy PPC? Crazy. There is the Lambo Yellow, lots of flamers, IATM9, 65 tonner, and this is Grimdark, 100 ton assault, dude. Wow. Alright, he probably is like melee base, right? Claws, upper spike, lower melee. Yeah, that's right. Large Vibro Sword. And what about the legs? Is there anything in there? J Talons. Okay, okay, okay. This guy needs to be taken apart carefully. Give me something. Gimme, give gimme, give gimme. Give Doesn't seem to have the directional jump jets though. <laughs> Lots of Solaris spikes. <laughs> okay, cool, fine, good. Now, what are we doing with this? I don't know yet. We need to, we need to, we need to somehow deal with them and then see what's left over later. All right, first time I see these things, by the way. Good. Elipolis, 
Is there a Lepolis running there? Oh, sniper artillery? No. The big steel. Whatever that is. It's big. And it's made out of steel. They also got a kaiju. Holy crap, this mission is gonna be... Uh, fantastic. It's gonna be really good, right? Holy crap. They have a lot of value sitting there. We need to crack them open quickly. I think fiddling around with those guys is not really an option because there might be one, maybe two lances later that are supporting these dudes. Lightning have a craft. Go lightning fast. All right. Cool. Got our plasma battle master. We can jump and brace, which we should do. Get in there. Primus Optimal. <laughs> so good. <laughs> oh boy. I mean, there's a lot of cre creativity going into that. That's sure. Okay. Archer, also move and brace. Just want to get it going now. Good news is that the Kaiju is rather slow and it's in the back line, so I don't think he's gonna get line of sight quickly. Macbeth, the Highlander. Repeating TSEMP and a pirate MRM40? No? How about... No? <gasps> ah! Alright, let's get in here and praise it up. What else do we have? An Atlas, sure. Let's go Atlas Sprint. Should have used my enhanced imaging and DNI, but I was so confused about the stuff that I'm seeing right now. Okay. Spawn protection removed. Now the fun begins. Turn 30. I think we saw battle armor here, right? Okay. Give him hell. Well, that's a little bit of damage. But okay. Here's our power armor. How close do we want to bring it? I think being in cover is maybe a good idea. Just go ahead and shoot something if we can do that at all, which we cannot. Whatever. Fire. Nothing happened. It's fine. Cool. What's the initiative here? 24 and 23. These guys will get in the zone. Absolutely. You're different factions? Wait. Oh no, you're fighting you're fighting the battle armor. Never mind. Never mind. Okay. So we now have turrets, and I think they already shoot this round, right? They now joined the initiative. Would be fantastic. They have some just extra damage out here. They're really going for those little guys. Great for us. Love it. So here's our Marauder. Let's go ahead and shoot. Optimus Prime in the back? This guy's nasty. This guy's so nasty. Okay. We go with this. High explosives. Fire. Laser AMS. Alright. I should really take care of this flying marauder as one of my first priorities. Those... MMS or MRM's society are no joke. Okay. Good damage. Was one of our APCs. And I kind of hope that the Marauder is also attacking either the Battle Armor or our APC or a turret or anything that is a low hanging fruit for them, but not one of my mechs. Phantasm? Who are you? <laughs> yeah. Okay, got some Decepticons as well. Cool. Lightning. Where do you want to go, Mr. Lightning? I kind of want to not do anything right now. Let's stay where we are. I'm afraid of this guy. We need to know what he's doing and then adapt. And we might need to go all in with a lot of sensor locks here. Yeah, okay. At the very least, he didn't shoot his artillery. Couldn't shoot it in the sky. Seemingly. Huh. Alright. So, Marauder. On the baller. That baller is down. But I am very happy that I was not the prime target for that guy. Also, he didn't really move that far this round, right? 
Or was it just a torso twist and now he's just jumping away like crazy? We'll see. Uh, eight evasion. Eight is doable. We don't have enough resolve yet, though. Okay. Okay, 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 okay. What are we doing now? I have an idea. Uh, so we, I think we're gonna jump here. I think it's fine if we generate a little bit of heat. Yeah, I, th I think it has to be a jump. It gives us more defense in general. We're gonna jump, like, right over here. Seems counterintuitive. But I wanna get an EWS ping out now. It's a lot of pinging. It's gonna be a tremendous help. But what I wanted is this guy. He's down to six. Yes, good. So it works. Great. Okay, bullet trap. I think we're gonna start shooting at the flyer, and we're gonna do it now. Not with Typhon, but with LK. Mm, this could be SAM, right? Lower hit chance? Although we are shooting a flying target? Interesting. What about incendiary? Wanna make him hot? Tandem. I think it's incendiary here. Don't think he has the best means to cool. And we have a lot of heat that we can drop on him. 76. I think he's gonna think twice before shooting next round. Very good. Alright. Get in that guy. Plasma rifle has 56% chance. It's pretty good. Could also try to hit Grimdark. He doesn't really have a melee target right now, though. So I think we're gonna stay in our primary target. Come on. Very good. Two hits. It's a little bit of additional heat, but more importantly, we got the plasma residue now, so that he is generating 15% more heat from fire. From weapons fire. From firing his weapons. Okay, turn. No, thank you! What? I want to go home? <laughs> well, I mean, I'm happy that we are still alive, but that hurt. Respect the hammer. Totally. Respect the freaking hammer. All right. Okay. I feel like we need to score a kill here this round. Let's try this. So close, but still so far. Okay, there's arrow ammo in there. Thirty-five percent to streak it. Yeah, I'll do it. Let's go. Let's try to get Optimus Prime down. Ah, we got one hit on the open side, but it didn't crit. There's more, though. We have still some things. I'm kind of banking on the Atlas getting something done here as well. And we have a dire wolf that's waiting. Don't like it. Don't like it. Got a weapon mount there. I don't want it that to get destroyed. Okay. What now? Turn 18. They still have a kaiju somewhere. What? You can do that? What? You can death from above a flying unit? I wasn't aware of that. It's cool, man. That's pretty cool. Alright. So, here comes the Atlas. Let's run in. While we have a pretty decent chance on the Marauder, I believe he is hot enough to not matter. Right? Let's do that. Alright. Optimus Prime is basically out of the game. He has a medium pulse left. He is now super, super hot. He's done. It's good. Mm-hmm. And this is just the first wave, guys. Holy crap. So, let's do some more 
Gals rifling. Unite on. <laughs> what do we shoot? What do we shoot? I think we're gonna shoot the Marauder. We got a rocket down at the very least, and the probe. And optics? And heat? Good. Battle computer down. I guess that's fair. So, the Prime is now completely gone. What about the Marauder? Okay, we got a crit on the MRM. Good. Also good. I really feel like we need to stay away... Great. Uh, away from these... Uh, Autobots and dudes that are... Flying around and trying to kill us with talons and stuff. <laughs> Yay, mortar. Let's go. Alright, 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 alright. How armor? Oh, we lost a unit. I just realized. Maybe that's okay. Oh, and I think we maneuvered ourselves in a very awkward spot. Huh. <laughs> well, let's go. We're gonna shoot what we can. And that is respectable damage. It's pretty good. Uh, it also seems like we have a decent initiative, so we can maneuver ourselves out of the hot zone. Quite reliably. What? That's a very brave attack. Wow! That phantasm is going down. Big time. Look at him! That's a lot of damage. I mean, is it like it's a medium, right? Medium size mech type? Insane. 22. Lumbo yellow. Doesn't do anything. Okay, it is really good for us. So, where to go with our Marauder, huh? We want to get away from this, that's for sure. I also want to kind of shoot things. We could jump the hell away and brace, but then we would overheat. Big time. Nine evasion is as good as it gets, so we'll take it. Okay, what can we shoot here? Our wing mounts should be able to shoot without a problem. ATM's too hot. Yeah, I hate it. But let's go for it. It's quad missiles. Yeah, period. Tiniest bits of damage here. Good. 10 seems decent. Again, mostly... Never mind. I wanted to say um, mostly wing mounted here. Heat sink kit is still fine. We don't care about that. Drop the bombs. Here we go. Everything's on fire. Sadly, one of the big bombs dropped here in the outskirts. That was not so good. Okay. Uh, keep pushing. Keep shooting. Uh, get the Highlander down now. Turret mount, jet booster down, PP, uh, MIRM crit. At the very least, we got that going. Okay. LK, here we go. Should be a kill. And it is. Oh, big, big, big explosion. I also hit the grim dark in the process. That's good. It's just a 45 tonner. No big deal. But I'm still afraid of the war... What are we doing about the Warhammer? Hell. I wasn't really thinking ahead here. You might even... Hit our Marauder big time again. And if so, he's probably making him unsteady. So we gotta keep him... Or get him under control. Hmm. Okay, supercharger it is. We need to go fast. We need to establish line of sight. And then we need to establish dominance. God, I hope that we get something like a direct overheat on this fool. Grim Dark is not one of our biggest concerns right now. One hit. Ah, this is not enough, but there's another target in front of him now. 
You might not opt for the Marauder, but instead shoot the Battlemaster at 8 evasion instead of the guy with 9. We'll see. Enableless. It's alright. That was mainly heat. Okay. Atlas. Atlas, Atlas, Atlas. Where to bring the Atlas? Putting it to the right side might be a good idea. Let's try that. Um, pretty good chance to hit, but uh, the rock is jammed. Well, I'm not gonna use my sensor lock ability yet. I don't think we need it here. Go tandem, but I actually wanna take him apart carefully. There's good stuff in there. I wanna get it. Got some spikes down. Fine. Unjam on the rock. Let's go. It's time for the Warhammer to show its uh, <clears throat> strength. Don't do it. Just skip the turn. Okay, we're still fine, but this is the moment where we'd want to disengage if possible. Again, this is what I was afraid of. I was not really thinking ahead when I did that. But hey. We're still there, we're still alive. The Kaiju is probably not gonna get in range, and then next round we're just gonna go. Just run. Another great opportunity for an attack, also presenting another target. Let's go. Grimdark needs to go now. The Boomstick could take my Marauder out of the sky. No streak. What? Bad for us. Kaiju, don't do it. Okay. I will accept that. That's good. So what are we doing about this massive melee mech up here? Guess we're gonna try to hit him and kill him. We have enough for an offensive push. Maybe we go for leg. Claws destroyed. That's not enough. So the good news is that Mr. Kaiju is getting very hot. Mama King Crab is toasty already. Left side is still fine. Yeah, I, I think this is... Where we're gonna just save the Marauder from just getting destroyed. We're gonna do like a full disengage. Hey. Got an injury. The arm down. I want the J talons. Which means I shouldn't attack the leg. What am I doing? Yeah, we need to attack the upper torso. Beast shield conversion gear. Yeah, that's just a, the basic thing of this mech type of thing, right? Carolamella, heatsink, gyro melee, double plus. Nothing that gives him accuracy for death from above. Seemingly. Alright. I can leave him there for the moment. There's no need to go anywhere. Alright. I'll go ahead and try to attack the Warhammer with more heat because I don't want him to shoot ever again. Let's go Hydra. And I think I'll go Sensor Lock on him as well. Negative two. Beautiful. All right, here we go. I'm scared and don't think I can take him this round, so we're gonna make him not shoot anything. Oh yes, that's good, that's really good. <laughs> Hydra, such a good weapon type or ammo type. Gotta make sure that the King Crab is taken care of. It's 24, he's rather fast. Great skirmish with the battle armor, I love it. Okay, I'll put the Atlas in here so we can do something about the King Crab. Sensor lock. Let's go. Negative two. Love to see it. That's gonna hurt. I don't think we're gonna kill here. So I'm gonna go Vigilant. Hey, there's some damage. And we got an injury. 
Because random fail chance? Can't say I like it. Okay, we do this. Oh, the leg is still here. Ah, the J talents are down. Oh, yeah, it's a shame. It is a shame. And keep in mind, guys, this is the first engagement. There might be more coming down around us. It means we should probably actually be very fast with the killing here. Ooh, they got flamers. Not good for the battle armor. Actually pretty bad. Hmm. Where to put the lightning? Go around here and try to attack Mr. Phantasm from the side. Also, I want to be fast enough next round to disengage again. Let's go. This is not quite enough. So he still can do a thing. What's next? Yeah, sure. Go ahead and attack the King Crab. I'm fine with that. 22. 22 is the phantasm now. Don't you dare crit me out somewhere. I still have all of my things. I just want to save this, alright? Okay, 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 okay. So, here's my flying marauder. Uh, we cannot stabilize. Ooh, how far can we jump away? It's not gonna fly. Not at all. So I think the best thing that we can do right now is make a left side twist. Zip. And brace it up. And hope that we cool down. Or we just completely overheat. Uh oh. I think it's just RNG. What can you do, right? What can you do? Cool. Uh, let's go for King Crab. Go Vigilant so we can do a double attack. Maybe. Like once now and then once later again. Oh, we don't even have to. Beautiful. I mean, we're getting there. That's for sure. We take the side. Again, the talents are down already, so we don't really worry about them. We want to actually maintain the other one. AGM is fine here. I think I'm going to keep the rest. Okay. So he's down. Wait. Now they say that the talents are destroyed? Oh. Eh. I don't know. You overheat. You gotta be kidding me. Relentless! This guy has a tail? Wait, no. The other guy has a tail. Like the... Berserker dude here. Um. Okay. So damn weird. Everything is just completely crazy here. Cool. Let's get him the heat. And we now know that he still wants to shoot. Ugh. So we're gonna go for it. Fire everything. Good. Very good. That might kill him. If we're getting lucky with the crits, his proto double heatsink kit is also crit now. He's gonna have a hard time cooling now. Uh huh. There's the reinforcements. Here they are. Enemy Vanguard. Not destroyed yet. Okay, we got one drop here. Another Lambo Yellow. Another Phantasm. And an EC EC131. The hell are you? I don't know. Couldn't see it. There might be another land somewhere else. Yeah, that hurts. And I hate the heat. Especially in an environment like that. It's just inevitable. Ah, yeah, there's the other lands. Another Grim Dark, another Optimal, another Yellow. Yeah, alright. We need to get out of the heat. Immediately. Okay. So. 
What can we even do this round? I think I vigilance and do nothing. I want to get out of this. Helepolis really needs to die because if he's doing it constantly, we are not able to defend ourselves at all. So that needs to that needs to change. That totally needs to change. Yeah, large double LRM fifteen clan. That's nasty. Man. We got some AMS though. That's good. Okay. Yo. Gotta go in here. I mean, Helapolis don't really have a good time uh, with heat in general. What about that? Go Hydra and Incendiary on him. Also, I really need that any now. We need to kill faster. Yeah, let's go with this. That's right. That's what you get, buddy. Also, questionable if I want to salvage that gun or not, right? From the front. Here we go. Kill. No. Crazy. Okay. What's to come here? A little bit of damage against the back of the Helepolis from the battle armor. That's brave, man. That's really brave. I think what we need to do here is something like a kick attack. Let's go with this. We kicked him. Let's see what it does. There we go. We got him. Ooh, I was a bit worried that he will attack us again. But he does not. Not in this game anymore. Day 27. Probably some stuff on the outskirts here. I really want to take another Grimdark apart. He seems very interesting. Maybe I can take another Talon out of this, so... Holding out for seven rounds ends this encounter here. Or destroying all of the enemies. I'm not entirely sure if I have the time to do that. I like destroying all of the enemies. So we probably want to focus more on the right flank and leave just the left flank where it is. Just leave it there. Don't worry about it. And I need to get out of the fire. That's for sure. Helepolis shouldn't shoot next round. I don't care about the, L the Lambo Yellow. Not really. I do. Never mind. I take it back. I ATMs, man. Yeah... They hurt. I mean, I only got five evasion right now. And two of them are being ignored by the ATMs. Okay. Come on. Give me a turn. Please. Thank you. Ugh. I hate that I'm so stuck. Oh, I'm not even stuck here. I was just doing it wrong. Okay. Never mind. Then... Heat will hurt. Anyway, somebody has to take care of this guy. Let's do it. Just getting on my nerves, you know. Also, it's a target that I don't want my turrets to shoot. So we take our low impact unit, try to take it down so that our high impact turrets can shoot something where it matters. More IATMs here. That was another yellow beetle dude guy. Lambo yellow. Yeah. Oh, so much. Okay. So far, so good. What's with my initiative this round? It's like so low. We have some fast movers here, but most of them are just really, really slow. And this is good for us. This is technically good for us. Alright, so again, we're gonna get out of the fire because that's nasty. Let's move here. I... I want to attack something that matters. So let's attack you, not with the mediums, they're way too hot. And I think I'm gonna shoot like five times. Okay. 
Couldn't kill. It's insane. Could not kill. I mean, we attacked from this from the fresh side of him. That's right. All right. Machine gun unjammed. He stays where he is. He's a prime target for a weapons attack from enemy fire now. Uh huh. All right. That means he's a good decoy. Enemies might attack him, prioritize him over me. 22. God, we are getting so pincered and I hate it. You know? That. That is a problem. Okay, Jamie, restart. Okay. We gotta defend. Okay, I'm gonna disable supercharger. Probably want to jump? Question mark? God, the hit chance is garbage. Let's move then. And get vigilance. So again, initiative. Next round might be good. And this is a long shot. I tried to overheat him in one go, so he's not in our back. Yeah, great. There's one stray plasma hit to the other guy, but that's it. Hmm. The backstabbers are, um, they are definitely gonna be a problem if you don't take care of them. Checking hit chance real quick. Helapolis is not one of our concerns. Okay. Let's do it. Good hit. I love it. His hip is destroyed, but it doesn't, doesn't do a lot, to be honest. Okay. Yeah, makes sense. <laughs> you are kidding me! Why? No! Mm, not cool. I am unsteady now, and I lost my arm. Holy crap. That was not cool, man. That's straight shot. Oh my god. Okay, okay, so what's your initiative on the side? 21, 21. That's lower than 22 that we have here. That's 27. Ugh. Okay. Yeah. I mean, yeah. Let's go Artemis. Last 60 shots. I will go as far as actually sensor locking this guy so we have a better follow-up hit chance. Could also... Who's 28? It's Wizard. I will offensively push this guy. This is all about survival now. Let's go for leg. He's now 24. I don't know if it's gonna help so much, but maybe a little. He might follow up with some other guys as well. We'll see. Could use the Phoenix Hawk now. Uh-huh. Uh-huh, uh-huh, uh-huh. Okay. Power Amur, Power Amur. Run here. This is not really about damage, this is all about his innie. I don't want him to attack my Marauder. And we dealt some damage as well. But that's good. Also unsteady now, easy target, the bam Stupid back strikers. I really feel like I have to. No sensor lock, sadly. But hey, let's see what we can do. It's all LK here. Let's just destroy that guy. If possible. Steady. I'll take it. Really good. Elepol is nothing. Right? Laser beams. Okay. We're still holding up. Relatively nicely. So, him unsteady means that I could maybe get things done. With the Battlemaster. Let's try. Mm, we didn't really get a shutdown directly. Got some more damage, got some more heat. 
But it's kind of funny here is that our little battle armor friends are helping us out big time. Okay. So you want to disengage from the main fight and you want to try to take this guy down now. So that's what we do. Uh, we also go Vigilant. And drop the bomb. Get his leg. Perfect. Perfect. Down he goes. Lowering his initiative even further. Great. Cool, now I can concentrate on the backstabbers here. This right flank, or former left flank, or former front line, is I think under control for the most part. Uh, hip destroyed. I want to get away. I just want to run. 25. What do you have? From here. Phantasm. I can deal with that. You go for the buildings as long as you want, as often as you want. Question. Do we care about the Phantasm down here? I say no. Scoot around and try to hit on the other side of the battlefield. Come on, streaks, please be good. Yeah! That's right. Okay. Panic level critical. Where to go with our very damaged friend? I have no idea. There is no good spot, really. This is as far as I could jump. And I will. Okay. Yeah, we have enough AMS now to intercept the IATMs. Oh, right. Ooh. A 14 uh, evasion jump is a lot, a lot of evasion. It's a lot of difficulty to hit. I think we should be fine. Let's see what Primus Optimal is gonna do. And again, I want the Grim Dark. I want him. The J Talons are gonna be so good. Alright. J Talons are. Wait a second. Can you put them in any mech? They are based on the mech's tonnage, right? But they're no fix for like 100 tonners or something like that. That's good. Okay. Oh, what an episode today, guys. We almost bit too much to chew here. But maybe it's uh, we could still go down. So let's let's not pretend that we are out of this yet. Let's stay focused. Clup clup clup. Okay. I want to have a turn. Thank you. Atlas Phantom. Yeah, right. We're gonna move this and we're gonna shoot down the Lambo Yellow with everything we got. Just take him out. Or maybe not. This is crazy. He's just taking all the damage without even blinking, yeah. And still attacks our battle armor with great success. Crazy. Oh, God. Alright. Offensive push against that guy. Not the hits I wanted, but maybe the hits I deserved. Okay. That's good. It's also good. Alright guys, this round we're gonna kill three enemies. We have to. Because last time we invested so much into getting this done and didn't do anything. Yeah. Eat? Yeah. Ho 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 ho! Okay. Um, 
I don't want to backstrike him. I want to side attack. Let's go in here. Get the yellow down. I wish I could attack the other leg, but hey. Let's go for this. We got him. Alright, one down. There's another one of this guy. Of these guys uh, on the other side of the battlefield we need to take. We need to take Halepolis this round. Because he's going to shoot more often now. Funny thing is that we still didn't get the Phantasm. He only has a Thunderbolt 5, so I don't really care. Okay, Ether. Yeah. Let's go down here. Every point counts. Although it was completely... It was a complete mess of armor damage all over the place and no criticals, but it's okay. Come on! Get him! I was really hoping for crits here. Alright. So the big steel seems to be a sniper rifle. Uh, sniper artillery of some sort. Okay. Our enemies have rather low initiative on the left side. The right side is still pretty high, but the left side is down. That's good for us. Five rounds to get things sorted. Again, we need to still go for the... What was his name? Grimdark. I want to get his stuff. Good. I mean, this is a 100 ton convertible, right? And we have two instances of those. Cannot move. Awkward. Go back. Try again. All right, there we go. Let's go down here and help out a little. I hope this is working, man. I really hope this is working. Got an arm. He's are sturdier than I thought. Crazy. Atlas. Uh, there's one spot to be... Outside of the flames. What can I even shoot this round? Can I even shoot anything? I could. Maybe we are crit fishing. Yes, case. Ah. Huh. Anyway, if we take that side torso apart, it's fine. Okay. Let's go for her labelist. The big steel is destroyed. It's good. That's that's helpful. I'll take it. Hmm. Where's my spot? This is a minimum distance problem that we have here. Uh, yeah, I guess. Through the minefield, whatever. Ah, sensor mines, I got it. Mm. Vigilance for any. We got five rounds again to get us ourselves sorted here. The other arm. Not what I wanted. Still have an ITM. Two ITMs. I ATMs even. Mm -hmm. I'm not worried about the buildings at all. We're fine there. Thunder A and Swarm. So what is my hit chance? 64 on the Grim Dark. There's a Halepolis, but he lost his main weapon. Ah, the fire is a problem, man. Such a problem. I don't think we're going to be able to really shoot that much anyway, so we might as well try to kill. What's left? What needs to be killed? Yeah. I can shoot one of those. Fine. All right. I really feel like I need to bring my dire wolf over to the other side of the battlefield. 
Because I want that Gauss rifle to be in position. We also need to make sure that the IATMs are not taking down my flying marauder. That's a lot of damage. Crazy. Okay. So. Where to put the plasma? Let's take bullet trap first. Move around a little. Get this sorted here. Good. That is so good. These guys are also filled with crazy amount of good equipment. I cannot wait to see the loot table after this. It's gonna be massive. You have the potential to take down my flyer. You're not going to, though. Great. Okay. This is good. This is really, really helpful. Hmm. Unobstructed line of sight is hard to acquire here in our optimal distance. So we go over here again, and we're gonna try to hit this somehow. Maybe we hit the guy in the back. Okay, we have a direct shutdown. Nice. I was waiting for that. So long. The repeating TS EMP. That's good. Okay, we're clearing up slowly, but surely. Means we can swivel over to the other side of the battlefield now. Jump for six. Okay, and depending on what we can hit, we either go for a headshot here, which we can always take. Or... A shot on the grim dark, straight to the core. Ah, uh, wait, we cannot go for a. Hmm, we cannot go for a, a call shot, so we need some resolve first. We'll take it here. This is not great. Ooh, but we're getting help. Yeah. All right. Thank you, friends. That was nice. Okay, okay, okay. Flank is getting under control. This is really good. Next. The problem that I see is that we have two friends on the sidelines. That are getting massively attacked. And we need to put more, more people over here. We want to shoot extended range. We want to stay out of the fight, mostly. Like this, maybe? Ah, oh, God, I hate it. Let's just get away from them. And use our range to our advantage. Kill this, come on. Another one bites the dust. Great. This is helpful. So, Phantasm I don't really care about. <laughs> the one that got hit so often still stands. And the other one is fresh, right? Yeah, it is. I, again, I don't really care about that much. It's not the biggest of deals. Let's rather bring some units over to the flank to help out. Hmm. I really want to see if I can hit the other Phantasm to take him down so nobody else has to shoot him anymore. Only from here. Alright, I'll do it. Should go Vigilant, should do it. And try! We finally got him. That's good. So, one more down. I really feel like I leave the, the back flank where it is right now. Don't need to go for uh, for any more kills here. These guys on the front are way more dangerous and need to be taken care of. So here's what we do. I'm gonna... Ooh, that's a great shot. I'm gonna go... I want a Typhon, not a Canned. Uh, is it Tandem? I don't think so. 
I think it is all LK except for one incendiary shot with the last remaining ones that we have. Let's go with this. Oh, one of them didn't fire. That's getting some heat. It's helpful for our thermal vision as well. Good. Atlas. Cannot really move properly here. I hate it. I could sprint out of this, but I don't want to. Maybe it's the right call. Let's get three evasion. Why not? All right, and we're gonna stay on the grim dark. It's the guy. Rack it up six times. Shoot. Not everything here. Nah. But I think I want to go vigilance, and maybe we go enhanced imaging now. He's currently guarded, so he's not really taking the most damage. I guess the better choice would be waiting for him to take a turn and then go for him. Let's do it. He's rather fast. I think it was 22 or something. Yeah. So we can easily wait for him to take a turn. Pretty good. Four rounds, by the way. Four rounds. The Phantasm is not one of my concerns. The yellow... What's it called? Yellow thing dude guy? Definitely is. And then Optimus Prime. He is nasty, man. It's really nasty. Do I even bother? I say no. We'll try to attack something here. Let's bring everybody to the front line. And yeah, there's a Phantasm <laughs> with a 2% chance to hit. Maybe? We do! Okay, and here's the strength of the streak. If we hit, we hit. Alright, pretty good. So, again, we wait for the other guys and then we go in. Prime is optimal. Don't hit the archer. Good. Very good. Buildings should be fine. Right? We shouldn't be in danger of not winning the mission. Okay. Alright guys, now it's our turn. Now we're going in. And then again, the question stands in the end, what the hell are we going to take? Some of these fancy mech parts? Or the talons? I really want to make that death from above build happen, and I, I, I couldn't in any of my series yet. Okay. Race for the next attack, man. A little too toasty. Two damage is not good. I want to deal more. Let's get Optimus down. Was that now better? He had two laser AMS intercepting some of my missiles. Was that a net worth higher than attacking the other guy? It is really hard to tell, but I think in the end we're gonna get this done. We still have a lot more instances of damage coming in now. Like now. Alright, here's AGM. Uh, he might be able to intercept that. Well, let's see. Maybe not. Alright, we have him narked. That is good. I think this is where we're gonna use our supercharger to close the distance a little faster. Let's go, old man. We got some plasma to apply. Is that it? Is this what we get? Fine. Oh, nice. 69% chance. Let's go. That's a lot of heat! Okay, pretty good. Next, the Gauss Rifling. Jumping on the high ground? I'm in front of a turret then? I don't want that. No, thank you. Nah, just, just move it. 
Just move it, move it. Hmm. Panzer push is doable. Not to the face, obviously. We hit the leg a bunch of times again. Okay. Weird choice, but I'll take it, I guess. Nothing. Right. We fight another round. It's Jamie. Bravely, bravely running away. And making a left side twist to the whole situation. Still shooting our... Uh, Long-range missiles! Here's the thing we can do. It's fine. Alright, good. And I was debating whether or not I should use ER ATMs or not. Now I really value them, so we can still be engaged while being very far away. Okay, okay, okay. Uh, getting in there. We need just a little bit to make him unsteady. So we try that with the heavy gals. Why not? 20%? Miss. Alright. Fair enough. We still have time to do that. It's no big deal. Uh, no backstrike, please. Ooh, but I also don't really want to get close to them. Okay, Kaspar, let's go. Uh, we can support the team a little bit by using, I don't know, sensor lock on this guy down here. No big deal. We definitely go vigilant and we want to use our last remaining bombs that we have. It's just for the instability of the whole thing. Didn't get it. Okay. In that case, gotta use the LRMs. We're almost running out of them. That's crazy, dudes. Typhon. All the way. Let's do it. Just shred his armor. He's even getting more heat. Now he's unsteady as well. And every follow-up shot will give him a lot of damage. Okay. And I already have the Atlas here waiting for it. Good. Yeah, I think I was right saying that we would kill everybody in this fight. It's not gonna happen. But our goal is to just live for three rounds, keep the buildings somewhat intact so that they don't fall and, and we should be fine. So Optimus Prime is, or Primus Optimal, is not gonna fire anything, I guess. The Phantasm is not really that big of a threat. We have two auto cannons from the Grimdark and a large pulse. Debatable if he is also shooting anything. But then there's also the yellow Lamborghini Beetle dude on the right side. Which is a bit nasty. Lambo yellow. And he's closing in. Oh yeah. Alright. Cool. So, at loss. Atlas, Atlas, Atlas. What are you doing, buddy? You know what? I think we attack the Grimdark. It's always a good chance for a headshot, randomly. Now we presented a target for them. Phantasm in the back. No! Ugh! Prime mover! My friend, we need to keep you alive somehow. I don't know if we can. On the turret. Okay. Yeah, he's having trouble with the seat. Definitely. That's a very good indicator, so we might just want to go and try to overheat him with our plasma that we got. Okay, I, I think it's under control now. But we have to still finish this whole thing. Are we burning? No. Moving forward slightly. Uh, yeah, I don't know. I don't know what to shoot here, really. Is this guy? Before he's doing anything bad. Just take him out. Now I don't have to worry about him at all anymore. I guess he was overheated. Next round he would just restart. 
but now he's out of the game. Okay, it's pretty good. That's a backstrike. But, at this point, we will just attack the Grim Dark because we need to think about our salvage as well. So let's go with that. So here we go. Some decent damage. And honestly, I really like the Lightning. It is not really dealing the most damage, but as a fast-moving tank, it's doing its job. Totally. That'll hit the Archer in the back if I do that. No. Let's go over here and hope for the best. Yeah, it's a little bit of heat, but it's okay. Great. Good hit chance. We need more. More like that next round, that's for sure. And this is certainly helping here. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Alright. Two rounds. And still a lot of enemies to grind. This is so crazy. Oh, uh, where to go? I don't know. We are going uh, over here. It's grim dark or nothing. Let's do it. 32 damage. I'll take it. I really don't care about the Phantasm. I really have the feeling, though, that I should take care of the IATM carrier here, the Lambo Yellow. He might bite me in the butt if I don't take care of him. Might, 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 maybe. There's a lot of ifs and thens. But I only have two rounds. And I need to make sure. Okay. Next up. Flying Marauder. I feel like I can still show my left side to them without the biggest of issues and we can shoot our extended range ATMs. Last 12 shots. That's alright. Alright, here we go. Battle armor. <laughs> Honestly, I love the battle armor here because they attracted so much fire that was not shot in my direction. They gave us time. They bought us the time that we needed to take care of everything here. Super good. Really helpful. Get in there, buddy. So, what type of ammo do we have left? SIM? LK? I think LK is fine here. Let's go. Good. Still so much damage to deal still. Um, I want to wait up here. Don't want to really go down because there's a guy with IATMs that I don't like really. Sure, the handheld doesn't generate heat. Fair enough. Now he's overheated. Means we can try to go for headshots now. That's nice. Uh, my archer is not in a good spot. Help, please. We want to generate as much evasion as possible, which is three here. We certainly want to go, I don't know, sensor lock that guy. Uh, evasion unchanged, that's fair. We go vigilance after. Can we take anything away from him? I don't know. Not like that, no. This is the best defense that we can get for the Archer right now. And I don't like it. Okay. So I'm juggling between offense and defense currently. Charge attack is not advised, I believe, no. Minimum distance is a problem. That's crazy. I wanna hit the guy up top. 
Wow, the lightning is lightning fast, but as soon as it stops moving, uh, or as soon as it's in motion, it's really hard to control it again. Ugh. I mean, uh, I guess that's good. Good enough at the very least. Fine. Fire at the center. Alright. Saito also exposed. I really want to see if we can find or get one of those convertibles in our lands. I want to play with them. Also, I want the Talons. I want both. Okay. Aspar, hold! One more turn. Then you can go wherever you want to go. This guy down here is too scary. And distance is defense. Just staying away from the enemy helps tremendously. On the Battlemaster. I'm fine with that. Good. It's pretty clear what we are doing next, huh? Trying to go for headshots on the Grimdark with our uh, Gauss rifles. Mm, let's wait a little longer. I want to see how this plays out. And we probably want to attack him from the side here. I don't care if I go overheat. It's uh, second to last round. That was unexpected. Oh, we also shut down. Interesting. Interesting. Okay. Fine. If you say so. That was not a good shot. That was not a good attack at all. Ah, okay. Fine. So we take this guy down. Now. Side down. Punch out. No. No, 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 no. You don't do that yet. And one more round. I feel like I need to take this Lambo Yellow because I am afraid of him. And uh, with the current situation as it played out now, it might be bad for us. <laughs> we don't take care of him. Like, now. So let's do it. By the way, Fastcam doesn't fire at all. I feel like we have to put it on the ground. Like, attack the ground. Alright. Good. That should net us a lot of parts. And it should net us... Talons. Like, left and right. Cool, cool, cool. With a bit of luck, we have this under control now. What a mission, man. It's a longer episode again. So, definitely no double mission today. But... It's one of the most interesting ones that I have been playing in a while. Yeah, you won't deal 200 damage against that thing. Not gonna happen. Not at all. That doesn't matter. Come on, guys, it's last round. Now the rover is coming in again. That's cool. Okay. Um. We're out of ammo completely. Yeah, I actually can do this. And shoot indirectly from here, which is not the preferred side, but it's a side anyway. Stress them out. Good enough. And that should be the kill. Got him. Oh boy, oh boy. So, last round. Three enemies to kill. I don't think we're gonna do that. But it feels good now. What are you, anyway? Phantasm. Alright. You have two Phantasms. And then there's another Phantasm up there. That's okay. That is totally fine. Um... I don't know if I even bother, if, if I even care destroying them. We should probably not destroy them in order to... keep the loot table uncluttered with stuff that I don't want, huh? I don't know. 
Maybe that's it. Maybe we just go into a defensive state and just don't do anything anymore. You know what? That's what I do. That's what I do. I don't care about phantasms. I do care about grimdarks and primal optimists or whatever they're called. I'm just gonna brace this now. Yeah. That's it. We did it. Last round, guys. The turrets will shoot again. I will not. Oh. That's a hit. That is no hit. And we're out of here. Holy crap. What a mission. But hey. Mission it's something different now. That was cool. And the thing is, they didn't even convert. They were only in mech mode the whole time. I wonder what they could have done if they were in tank mode, in vehicle mode. I mean, they, they have to be able to convert, right? That's their deal. These are Transformers, let's be real. Cool, we get money. That's good. We do have a lot of repair. Only the hip is critical, though. <laughs> okay. Okay, probably about 500,000 in repair cost. Can we take them? Are these salvageable? It doesn't seem like it. Quickly going through this. All the way to the bottom. Yeah, we cannot. We cannot salvage these. That is a shame. Oh, man. Okay, that being said. Makes it rather easy on the on the picking stage then, right? Because I already told you that I want to have some very, very specific things. Also, clan arrow. We have no clan arrow yet. Hmm. Do we have ammo for that? Got arrow ammo, but I think you need clan arrow uh, ammo, I think. Hmm. It's a good thing. Let's consider it at the very least, all right? It's a very good weapon. IATMs are even better. IATMs are fantastic. We have two of them available here. One LRM-15 clan. There's an MRM-45 society, which is a no-brainer. Society weapons are crazy strong. We're gonna take them, no questions asked. That is a weapon that is, I think, comparable to an MRM-30, but has just 15 more missiles. Let me, let me take a look. Going over here for it. MRM 40, let's say 30, is 10 tons, 5 slots, 150 damage for 27 heat. This here is 8 tons, 5 slots, lighter for 225 damage and 50 heat. I mean, yeah, it generates more heat, as it should. But at the same time, the damage output for the tonnage investment is crazy I'll take it repeating TS EMP another one let's go but I don't think I'll do it advanced optics mark 3 they are wonderful but we have other things that I am eyeballing right now battle computer optics is nice as well claws are fun cooling jackets oh god I can only hope for good random salvage here Interface cockpit is okay, Clan XL is fine, Enhanced Imaging is fine, Exchangers. The Berserker Fire Control System for 2 melee accuracy. That's nice, man. What do we have? We have Fire Control System melee and then... There's another one that gives you, I think, 1 melee accuracy and 1 initiative. This one is 2 melee accuracy. It's good. It's really good. It's very specific though, so it's, it's not an all-round good thing to have. Lamb composite. Modular armor. Alright, pretty good. Nova CEWS. We could really switch over to Nova. This is a primary CPU. That means you don't need a pilot for that if you put that in a Mac or in one of these things, right? I don't know. Supercharger, Talons, yeah, yeah, yeah. These are regular Talons. I was looking for Jade Talons. That's a VR pod, I'll take that. No, not even thinking about it. Ah, so, wait. You are saying that the Jade Talons are being 
reduce to regular talents if you salvage them? I don't like that. It said Jade Talons when I was fighting them. And now I get regular Talons in the loot section here. This is not cool. I think I'll take them anyway because they are good for Death From Above and we are still trying to make this happen. Somehow. I know it's not smart to do that. But it's the more fun thing to do. 25% multiplier here. Yeah. And we have zero of them currently. So the VR pod is fine, the, the society MRM is fine. What I, what I would have taken, if not taken the Talons, was probably a turret mount. Maybe the IATMs. Nova CEWS is extremely good. Defensive double plus is good. All of these gunneries A and Bs are fantastic. Uh, enhanced imaging exchangers are fun. Cooling jackets, rare items that you cannot really find that often. Super good. Um, optics battle computer, Optics Mark III. We have a Clan LRM-15. There's so much good stuff here, and the arrow. But hey, I'm gonna opt for these, and we're gonna have some fun with them. We get the Kaiju part. Hey, we got an IATM. One is fine. LRM can go. Advanced optics. Nice. Engine heat sinks plus four. Energy fire control system. Scatter fire control system. PPC capacitor. A primary CPU. A jammer. Talons. The mount. Nice. Upper spiked. Sure, whatever. And then three bins of MRM ammo to fuel our new MRM. I think we're going to have some fun with that thing. Guys, that has been it for today. I hope you enjoyed the episode as, us as per usual. And if you did, as always, don't forget to leave a rating. Subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. Let's not uh, yeah, miss any episode anymore. Click that bell icon on top of that. And I hope to see you next time. Goodbye.